Good Tuesday morning, everyone. Vince Bryan here with BAM Weather. Wanted to give the latest forecast briefing here as we have a very active, really next 24 to 48 hours here across the Ohio Valley. Not so much this morning, you can see really Aside from a few wind advisories in the southern portions of Indiana and Illinois, all we have contending with right now are a few very, very light rain showers here, southwestern portions of Illinois. Those are going to gradually work their way east here as we head throughout the day here. You'll notice we kind of progress into the late morning, early afternoon hours. A lot of dry air near the surface. It's going to help, I think, evaporate and really limit the amount of moisture that can come out of those kind of sprinkles, a light rain shower here. So again, plenty of drier hours as we head throughout the day, but it's going to be kind of in the afternoon time frame from St. Louis along that I-70 corridor. Going to watch closer towards the mid now. Here's the late afternoon, 4, 5, 6, and 7 p.m. for some light rain showers to really develop from the Chicago areas down towards Indianapolis, Cincinnati. These will continue to progress their way off to the east. Again, just want to note, this is light rain we're talking about here. That's kind of what's, what is expected. This will continue as we head into the evening. Now the overnight hours here may have to watch for even a little bit of a, a wintry mix, some freezing drizzle working in southwestern portions of Michigan, northeastern Ohio here. Then as we get into our daybreak time frame tomorrow, some widespread rain showers across the northern portions of Illinois. Things become even a little bit more interesting in terms of the forecast as we head kind of late morning, early afternoon. You can see this narrow line of precipitation here. Could be moderate to at times heavy for a brief period. This is kind of associated with could be some strong to severe storms, mainly in the form of strong winds here. As I'll touch on in just a moment, isolated tornado cannot be ruled out really in the southern portions of Illinois and Indiana. But I think wind gusts are going to be the primary threat here. And you'll note as we get into the afternoon now, here's 4, 5, 6 p.m., of our Wednesday. This line works towards central Indiana. And then as we head into the evening time frame, here's after sundown on our Wednesday night, this precip just gradually breaks up as it heads further east into kind of eastern portions of Indiana, western and central Ohio here. Here is that severe weather threat that I was talking on. This is not for today, the Tuesday here. This is for our Wednesday. This green area, I think we need to watch for the potential of some strong wind gusts, you know, 40, 50 plus miles an hour in some of that, that line that works across the both states here. Again, that, that would be definitely possible. And then these areas in yellow and even in orange far the southern tip of Illinois here, or if, of, yes, of Illinois here, could be looking at, again, strong wind gusts and isolated tornado cannot be ruled out. Speaking of those winds, as we go throughout the day today, guys, coming from the southeast, I think sustain much of Illinois and Indiana, 10 to 20 plus miles an hour. But I really want to draw your attention to tomorrow. Look at some of these sustained winds coming from the south, 20 to 30 miles an hour gust 30 to 40 plus miles an hour and like i said in some of these strongest of cells as this front passes could be some 40 50 plus mile an hour gusts so tomorrow it's going to be warm but it's also going to be very very breezy out there those winds are ushering in those warmer temperatures guys as we get into our thursday real quickly just want to touch on this i do think we're going to need to watch for a quick wave of some light precip Thursday night. As it stands right now, I do think Friday morning could offer up the potential of a few very light spotty snow showers, northeastern Indiana, northern Ohio. And then for the weekend, gonna need to watch kind of midday for portions of Illinois, late day for portions of Indiana, some light rain showers as they work into the state. Sunday may have to watch the morning hours of northern Ohio for some light snow. Guys, if you haven't heard, we are hiring a part-time meteorologist here for some of the job description. If you have any questions, want to send your resume cover letter over email, michael at bamwx.com. Guys, have a great rest of your Tuesday.